Maria. Who is that? Who? Is that Maria? Is that my friend? Is that Ojuku? Is he really? You stopped the car. Adana! Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, I'm doing well, as you can see. Yeah! <laughs> you still hunt? Uh, well, yes. Uh, I know it's my hobby. I, I can't leave I it to you. I know! I miss you so much! Same! Same! Come here! Same! I miss you! What is the meaning it, of this? It has Adana? been ages! You know him, that's my friend, you remember him? Uh, my prince. He's your father and yeah. everybody else. They're fine, they're all fine. How's your flight? <laughs> Great. I don't know. I, I'd like to have this. How much will it cost me to have it? Papi says you can have it. You're kidding? Yeah, no, you can have it. Oh my god. I wish you knew you were coming it. back. Thank you. Take this thing and get out of here. Listen. Pride and poverty dwell together, not light and darkness. I don't know you are royalty and you shouldn't be doing this. You shouldn't embarrass me. Stop it. I don't know. My brother can leave. Get into the car now, let's leave here. Sorry, did he hurt you? I don't know, you know what it means if I leave this place without you? Get into the car, Will let's you leave. stop it? What's wrong with you? If I see you anywhere close oh to the princess, God. you're going for it. I don't know, get into the car, let's go. Open this car. I don't know. Riff raff like him! Stop it! Get it in!
one they are preparing for her return. Father, we regret this. I wonder what's going to be responsible for that. I don't know. Her attitude changed the moment her father announced yesterday that the princess of Eruberry Kingdom will be returning from the United Kingdom today. I don't think that's the reason. My dear, I don't know. Ole Do used to be very cheerful until yesterday. Are you trying to say that she's not happy about the return of the princess of Eruberry Kingdom? Princess Adana is back at last. Your father was so happy when I gave him the news about the princess arrival. Yeah, he should be happy. Why well, would he be happy? You know, after all these years. He should be happy. You see, that was why I was waiting for you so I can get um, first class information from you. We can't wait to see her arrive here tomorrow. <laughs> I wonder what she looks like after all these years. Holedo, what is wrong with you? Since yesterday, you just changed. What is the matter? Tell me. The guards and the maidens are clean and dusting everywhere. Yes! Princess Adana is visiting for a banquet. I see. Adana is coming here for a banquet after returning from Europe. Of course. Anyways, I have nothing to say now. Ikenga, didn't you tell your sister that Adana is coming here for a banquet? Uh -uh. But why is she not happy about Adana's visiting? Mom, actually we were discussing something very important, you know, a more important matter. So tell me, just, just tell me everything. Oh, Ikenga, it's necessary I find out what is bothering your sister. Ikenga. She used to be a happy and humorous person. Uh, but her sudden change of attitude gives me a big concern. I don't know what has come over her. Mom, you can do that later, okay? For now, let's discuss something more important. You know, Adana has been out of the country for over 10 years. Yes. You know, I, I wonder what she'll be looking like. I know, she, you know, before she left, you know, she used to be a very beautiful girl. And I know now she'll be, you know, like a real princess. Now she is. <laughs> so how is she? So tell me, tell me. Uh, she's very okay. Of course, I'm happy that she's coming here tomorrow. We all are happy, my son. No, oh, she needs to come here tomorrow. Oh yes. yes. Uh, Which is but... my what do you want? Someone is here to see the prince. Tell the person I'm coming, okay? Okay, my prince. So I was actually saying after ten whole years. Okay, thank you. Mama, what are you doing here? Is that your welcome, Kinga? Is that how to welcome your loved one? You should inform me before coming to my house. Hey, Kinga, and why are you talking to me in that manner? Have I been informing you before coming to your house? Because the story has changed. Ikenga, what story are you talking about? The story between you and I. The whole thing has changed. Okay, I, I mean, the, this whole relationship thing, I mean, we don't need it anymore. Okay, it's a quit for us. What? Is that a joke? Oloma, it is not a joke. Ikenga, what has come over you? And why have you decided to break my heart this afternoon? Why? 
Eh? What wrong have I done to you? Have I wronged you in any way? Look, you've not wronged me and it's not about breaking your heart, okay? The truth is that Adana is back. Adana is back, so we need to call this thing off. I mean, we can't continue with this whole relationship thing. We can't continue anymore. It feels like Adana. Yeah. <laughs> King God. King. Good afternoon, my queen. Thank you. Ikenga. Huh? See me upstairs. Okay, ma'am. You see, Oloma, you just have to leave, right? You just have to leave. This whole thing is not going to work. Please. <laughs> This whole thing is not going to work, it's right? It's not going to work, yeah. But this is not what you told me from the beginning. Ikenga, what have I done to you? Why are you doing this to me? Why? Oloma, you just have to leave. You should leave before my father comes here to see you. Ikenga, you know what? I am not going to take this from you. Oh, you are doing all this thing because of another woman from another kingdom? Huh? But let me tell you this, I would rather die than take this from you. But I am not telling you to die. What I'm telling you is, I mean, the whole thing has changed. It's not going to work. I know why you're doing all this thing to me. Because you know I love you so much. This is not about love. This is about Adana. Adana is back. That's the truth. I don't care. Then you just have to leave before my father care. comes here. I don't want my father to come here and see you. So you just have to leave. I don't want to know. I don't care if she's back or not. I don't care. I'm not asking you to care, you just have to understand. Ikenga, you are really hurting me. Are you really hurting me, Ikenga? Is it a crime to love you, is it? What is that girl doing here? Um, Mom, I did not invite her. Uh, I mean, she, she just said she's looking for me, that she came looking for me. I did not invite her. And what stopped you from sending her away the moment you saw it was her? That was exactly what I was doing before you called or before you came in. Ikenga. Mom. Let today be the last time I will see that girl in this palace. Did you hear me? Now. Go there and send her out. Go and dismiss her right away. She's gone already. You are lucky your father did not meet her. Oledo. Oledo, what is the problem? Talk to me. I am your mother. I'm fine. I know you too well. You are not fine. Tell me what the problem is. Just what tell me. I am your mother. mother. I am I fine. Oledo, talk to your mother. I said I'm fine. You I'm are not fine. fine, Oledo. You are not fine. I want to be left alone. Oledo, are you ordering me out of your room? Is it me you are talking to? Well, I, I am ready to listen to you whenever you are in the right frame of mind to tell me what the problem is. daughter go well may our ghost lead you to that place extend my greetings to my very good friend he would enter 
Hmm? I will die. Yes. And my greetings to my good mother-in-law to be. <laughs> She'll hear, mother. I don't know, please. Let's get going. Uh, driver! Yes, it's Majesty. Uh, driver! Yes, it's Majesty. Drive safely. Oh, you know why you're here? You're here. Prince Kenga. Wow! It's such a long time. <laughs> yeah. Adana's return has brought us to me again. Yeah. Alright. <laughs> That's good. Let's take it inside. Take it inside. Hi! She's here at last. I hate her so much. May God curse the day she was born. She's the curse of my agony. I can never get away with it. Look at me. Take a good look at me. Princess Oled of all people. Hi. 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 Yeah, very well. In fact, you said there are regards as usual. Oh, that's good. That's good. And you know, my, my, my parents just can't wait to see you. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Wow, we can wait to see them too. Come on. Let's go. Thank you, my man. That's pretty good, my man.
Thank you, my queen. Thank you. Madonna, I want to sincerely say I am happy you are back home. Um, After so many years abroad, you're welcome. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Your Highness. I am very grateful to you and your entire family for everything. I do not even know how to begin to express my gratitude, to be sincere. I am deeply overwhelmed. <laughs> Thank you again, my <laughs> queen. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. I don't know. I don't know why this should come from you. Because you are more like a daughter to me. Yeah. In fact, um, as a matter of fact, whatever I have done for you, I have also done for myself. And this entire family. <laughs> Your Highness, you're such a kind-hearted man. Thank you very much. Dear. Gratitude is the least we can do. I mean, <laughs> I honestly lack the right words. Sorry, my friends. I honestly lack the right words to convey the gratitude of the entire royal family and the uh, entire people of the Rubber Kingdom to you, Your Majesty, for your kindness. It's um, overwhelming in our eyes, and we say thank you. You can say that again, my Thank boy. you, Highness. You can just say that again. <laughs> because all of you are like my children. Yeah. My relationship with your father and I started from childhood. In fact, we were like brothers. At a time, our parents began to wonder the kind of children we were. <laughs> because the relationship was too tight, too close. We were both standing for one another. We were standing for one another and fighting for one another. For the interest of both of us. Oh. So wonderful. Yes. <laughs> we were like brothers. And that is why this relationship went on and on. And our kingdoms were like one. You know, that, that is nothing like um, a pure coexistence. Yes. You are right. Yes. You are very right. And that is why both families have decided to seal the bond of marriage between both of you. Oh, my family, your highness. <laughs> and in fact, um, don't worry, any moment I know the marriage arrangement will be carried out since she is back. Yes. And I will have a special gift for the both of you on that day. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, your highness. Thank you, Thank Thank you, you my queen. Thank you, Mom. Thank you. Excuse me, where, where is Olodo? She has not been here. I have not seen her. I have not set my eyes on her. Where has she been? I sent the maid to call her earlier. So. But I do not know why she's not here yet. Mm -hmm. uh, Chica! Yes, my queen. Please go to my daughter's room. Tell her her father wants to see her immediately. Yes, please. Okay, my queen. Um, you see, I I noticed something about Olado of recent. She has not been herself. Have you asked her? Yes, I did, but she refused to talk. She didn't tell me anything. Okay. Okay. We will talk about that later. Of course. Gentlemen, you can eat. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Highness. Everybody eat, enjoy yourselves, okay? Eat up, eat up. Your Highness, this your wine is really vintage. Really? And, and I just took the last one. Yeah, I want to see. 
a problem. She's not opening the door. My queen, I doubt if she's in her bedroom. Have you tried to check if she's somewhere else in the house? No, my queen. Now go outside and check on her. Yes, my queen. What is wrong with your lady? What has come over her all of a sudden? All of a sudden she just changed. Oduku, you like because Papa? Oh? I thought you went to the palace. I'm coming from the palace. I I was wondering why you came back so quickly. I was told that Igwe was having a, a rest, so I decided to come back. Papa? Uh, I is the princess. I mean, I, I is my princess. I didn't even stay out. They told me she went to Mwago to go under the border. Though I will be there, I will, I will go back in the evening. All right. Maybe I might see her. All right, okay. Come on. Ah! Oh, well, you need the need. She went to Umago with the Kuna. I know she must have gone there to see that useless Prince Ikinga. Tell me, how was life in Europe? <laughs> yeah, life out there was very beautiful. I mean, it was beautiful. As expected, <laughs> it's the Western world. But that's not to say that it's anything compared to Africa. I mean, Africa remains the best. Our culture and our values that I hold so dear is nothing compared to what you see over there. Yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised you're saying this, you know. Really? No, uh, to me, Europe is, is life. Europe is everything. Really? Yeah. I'm surprised you would say that, but that's your opinion anyways. Yeah. For me, home is the best. And by home, I mean Africa. At least that's what I tell my friends over there. <clears throat> you have your, your own opinion, I have mine. That's know. right. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Whatever you say, yeah. yeah. But on the real though, I am worried about your sister, Olido. What's really going on with her? Well, I truly don't know, but... I mean, Ola... Ola, she doesn't want to talk to anybody. Why? I don't know, and talking to her will be just a waste of time. So. That's, um, that's really surprising because the old lady that I know will be very excited to see me now that I'm back. So I find it very weird. So, you were in Europe for 10 whole years. Mm -hmm. Tell me what was going on there. Just
your mother. What is your problem? Tell me what the problem is. I am fine. You are fine? I will not take that as an answer. Because that is exactly what you always tell me each time I ask you what your problem is. Now tell me your problem. Mother. What is your problem? Huh? I said I am fine! Why do you always like to put words into my mouth? Just leave, I don't want this Thomas. Oledo, is it me you are talking to with such arrogance? Oh my God. Well, since you don't want to tell anybody what your problem is, I don't care. And I think I should let you be. I have to let you be from this minute. Your Highness, we are very happy. Over Princess Adana's return. Mm, yes, yes. In fact, I am grateful to the gods of our land who brought her home safely. I don't know who is your but it's not easy at all. Not only that, our daughter is now a medical doctor, trained by the white men themselves. <laughs> hey, it is marvelous indeed. If all folk are better going to die. I feel my little man. I feel my man. In fact, I owe a lot to my good friend, he would enter. He's a friend like no other. Hmm. A friend in need. It is said he's a friend indeed. In so. ah. He will enter. He's not a friend to you alone. I don't. I know. I know. He is a friend to the entire Eruberu kingdom. May the gods continue to bless him, his family, and the entire Umago kingdom. Amen. Amio. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Your Highness, I'm in support of what Onowu said a while ago before he left here. Um, the return of the princess calls for celebration. This is true. This is true. Looking forward to that. Um, greetings, Your Highness. Ah, Ojuku. How are you? I'm very fine. My brother, I greet you. You are welcome, Ojuku. Your Highness. I actually came to um, welcome our princess, but I was told she's not at home. Mm. Thank you, Highness. Um, I have to take my leave now. May the gods of our land guide you. He say, thank you, Your Highness. Thank you, Your Highness. Um, Your Highness. I'm always happy each time I see this industrious young man. Who knew is highly favored to have him as his son? Yes. yes. Ojuku takes after his father. Okay. Oh no, who was such an industrious young man when we were young. Um, I have heard what you said. And um, I will look into it. You know, the safe arrival of my daughter from Obodo Ibo, home to this kingdom, calls for a big celebration. And um, you know how my things go. <laughs> <laughs> Hola. Why did you decide to lock yourself indoors throughout today? Answer my question. Nothing, Father. Nothing? What do you mean by nothing? Will you answer my question? Oledo. Why did you suddenly become so stubborn that you cannot answer your father's question? Huh? Oledo, will you answer my question? I truly don't know what the problem is. But you see, whatever it is, I mean, keeping quiet is not going to be your solution. It's not going to solve anything. For the last time, Answer my question. I'm sorry, Father. I'm not in the mood to talk about this. Oledo! Oledo! 
follow. The earlier you answer my question, the better for you and I. Answer my question, Oledo. Now, Oledo, calm down. Calm down, my daughter. Tell us, who must have wronged you in this house? Is it your father? Your brother here, or myself? Tell me, tell us. We are here together now. Talk to us. Mother, I said that I'm not in the mood to talk about this. Will you shut your mouth up? Oh, you don't want to talk to anyone in this house again? I wish you good luck. Thank you. My princess, I, I am honored to have you in our house. Well, I'm happy to be here. I was told you visited the palace yesterday. Yes, and I was told you went to Marble Kingdom. Mm -hmm. That is correct. I visited the king and his household. <laughs> of course, I knew it wasn't the king you went to see, but the prince. Oh, please, I was only joking. Uh -huh. Please. Anyway, I came to personally thank you for the gifts you brought my way yesterday. Thank you. You're welcome. I, I'm glad you like them. I love them. I really do. They're beautiful. Especially the bangles. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I was equally told that it is you who brings palm wine to the palace. Yes, you're correct. <laughs> I want some. What? My princess, you want some palm wine? Mm-hmm. I tasted the ones you brought to the palace yesterday and I loved it. Now I want more. Can I have more, please? <laughs> All right. Uh, it will be my pleasure. Mm -hmm. okay, but please, we, we have to do it tomorrow, okay? Okay. So I can get you fresh palm wine straight from the tapas oh. table. <laughs> All right, then. I can't wait. <laughs> How much will it cost? I'll give you money. I'll oh, give some money. Oh, please. Don't bother. Okay? I will get you the power like I promised. Really? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome, my princess. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, how is your father? Is he around? No, he's not around, uh, but he's fine. He's doing very, very fine. Okay. Well, I extend my regards to him when he comes back. All right, are we your princess? I'll take my leave now. Thank you for coming. come to give answers to my questions? Yes, Father. You can go on now. I'm all ears. <sighs> I'm angry, Father. Is that all? Over what? My right was given to a stranger. That your right was given to a stranger? Now tell me, what right are you talking about? And who is the stranger? The right I'm talking about is the scholarship award he secured for me 10 years ago. And the stranger is Princess Adana. Father, you treated me as if I'm not your daughter. All I know. Is that an accusation? Yes, Father. How could you have valued another man's daughter more than your own daughter? How could you have done that, Father? What are you doing? You are raising your voice at your father. Have you gone insane? Daughter, I sent Adana abroad because I want her to be the queen of my son, the prince, your brother. Yes. And that automatically makes her a member of this family. Can you see my reason? 
Can you see the reason she is not a stranger? She is a stranger. I'm not surprised. You love and adore Adana more than your own daughter. Oh, come on. This is totally absurd. Oh, will you shut up before I give you a dead slap? Go ahead. What has come over you? I said go ahead and slap your mother. Oledo, I already knew that I'm not your daughter. So go ahead and slap me. Slap me, mother. Slap me. Are you talking to me in that manner, Oledo? Why do I not talk to you? Who are you? Oh, excuse me. house again. What does she do? I don't know. She has refused to open the door. She has not said anything to us. In fact, I'm sick and tired of her attitude. Don't say that. She's your sister. I know. Maybe I should come and talk to her myself. No. Don't be need for that. You don't need to. Really? Yeah. Well, she's your sister, so you know what you have to do. Oh no, take this back. I will eat with my hands. So okay. please give me water to wash my hands. This is better enjoyed with bare hands. I don't know, you're a princess. You shouldn't be doing this, yes? Well, <laughs> besides, meals like this are better enjoyed with your hands.
delicious. Well, you shouldn't be doing this here, trust me. You're right. This is really nice. You should try it. Well, at least eat your rice. I already brought some for you yesterday. Yeah, and it's finished. <laughs> Please get me more. I, I, I really love palm wine. I heard that it nourishes the body. Ain't that right? Yes, you're correct. It does. Uh, oh, all right, my princess. Uh, tomorrow, I'll get you some. All right, all right then. I'm, okay. I'm looking forward to receiving my palm wine. No problem, my princess. And I'm paying for it this time. Don't say no. Don't do that. <laughs> Please oh. get some money for him. Um, just one thousand naira, princess. Alright, she'll get you some money. Thank you. You're welcome. How you been? I've been off and on, climbing, walking. Mm. Just have to be busy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here you go. My princess? Yeah. I said one thousand naira. Okay, you can use the rest of the money for your transport fare. <laughs> My princess, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. To see Genga's father. Yeah, how did he go? He went to discuss about uh, your traditional marriage. I'm sorry, what? What did he say? <laughs> My traditional. Why? Why wasn't I told? I mean, shouldn't I have been told even way before my father embarked on that journey? Why are you sounding like this? Must you be told before he embark on the visit? Yeah. Well, I think your major concern should be the outcome of their meeting. Well, yes. Mother, I am bothered, all right? There seems to be an issue with the Kenga family, and it's not yet resolved until then. I'm settled about this whole thing. What issue are you talking about? It's Olidu, his sister. She has been behaving strangely since I returned. And judging from what the king has said, her withdrawal has to do with my return indeed. Um, I can't get you. What are you trying to say? I have a hunch that Olidu just might be unhappy with my engagement to her brother. Oh. That is not true, because I never heard him mention anything like that. You don't think they discuss everything, do you? See, your father and the Kenga's father have been close friends for a very long time now. So I don't think he will hide such thing from him. Well, it might interest you to know that a date for your traditional marriage has been fixed.
Is anything the matter? No. Nothing is the matter. Ikinga, good afternoon. But what is it? Why are you trailing me? Ikenga, I am here to beg you not to break my heart. Please, don't do this to me. Because... No, I told you even while we were in school. I told you, I, I mean, I have a serious relationship with Adana. See, we're going to get married immediately she comes back from her studies abroad. So I don't know what you're talking about. Ah, Ike Please. Ikenga, hold on, hold on. But you know very well that we have gone deep with each other. And you cannot leave me now, not now, no, please. My cats are here, my guard is here, and the others are watching also. Please, don't embarrass me, alright? Kinga, please. Kinga, please. Go out and watch him, please. You're embarrassing me here, you're embarrassing me seriously. No, please, 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 please. Kinga, please. Why can't you just understand? Just, just admit it. I know. This is, it is over between us. Listen, Flora, listen to me. It is over between us. It is over. I can't. In I don't know if it's going to come back, okay? And our, our marriage is going to hold. In fact, we have already fixed a date for our traditional marriage. So there's nothing I can do anymore. Don't you get it? Please. Please, what? Please, you can't go. Please, I love you. Please, you can't. You're embarrassing, you're embarrassing I, me. I don't care. Let them watch, please. Let them watch what? Please, you can't. I don't anything for you, please. I don't mind anything for you, Kenga. My princess, here is the place. This place is not meant for someone like you. Look, your father will have me hanged if he ever hears I brought you here. Is that why you're making a face? Yes. Really? My princess. How are you? I'm good. You work here? Yes. What's your name? Amara. It's nice to meet you, Amara. Hey. Give us a minute and we'll make our orders. Okay, ma. scared of my daddy. My princess, I just hope you know what you're doing. Listen, OJ, nothing has changed about me. I am still the same old Adana you knew years back. Except that now I am an adult and I have my life to live. So would you lighten up? Princess. Let's make our order now, shall we? Okay. So what's the best dish over here? You tell me. Uh Alright, we're, we're ready to What is the best doing inside there? What is she doing inside there? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let it not be that she went inside there to eat because the majesty will be very angry with both of her if he hears this. What is she doing inside there? Yes, you're right, but well, there's nothing we can do about it. Jane, don't say this. She is the princess. Don't say this. We can't stop her. Can we stop her? No problem. What the fuck will suffer you that? We are just servants here. Jane. Jane. Why is it so hard for Oloma to understand me and go her way? I have tried all I could to convince her, but she didn't want to listen to me. 
I did not know she can be this old. Well, I think I know what to do. My brother, the prince of Omagu Kingdom. I'm surprised you are not bothered about your only sister's current state of mind. Hello. What have I not done? What have I not said to you to forget about the past and face the future? And do you think this do you think getting yourself so drunk to stupor will make you forget about the past? You oh. just sounded like a pressure man on the pulpit. As if you really care about me. I know that all of you are happy about my current state of mind. Because you all are responsible for it. Let me talk to you, my dear beloved sister. I care about you. I love you so much, my dear sister. But whatever that is happening, you, all I do, brought it upon yourself. Is that what you said? Is that what you said? Love and care kill you there. You turned me into a drug. You turned me into a drug. God will punish all of you. In, in fact, God will punish you in this house. I will deal with all of you. Don't talk to me. Calm down for what? Don't you dare call my name again. Don't you dare. I will deal with you in this house. This won't help you. I won't. You just have to calm down. You can go. What is the problem? You are the problem. All of you are the problem in this house. You see, you wicked mother. God will punish all of you. I will deal with all of you in this house. Oledo, will you stop this? I will not! Stop. I will not! Mother, leave me alone, you wicked mother. Leave me alone! Just leave me! Leave me alone! Leave me! All of you should get tired. Oledo! Leave me! Leave me! Oledo! Leave me alone! Oledo! your son, Ochuko. Yeah. Is he around? Uh, he's inside. Yeah. Let me tell him that you are around. No. Take me to the place where we went to the other day. You know, the food place. My princess, you can't go there again. Why? Your father will skin me alive if he finds out. Oh, please, forget about my father, all right? I'm a lover of native food. I, I love their food so much. I couldn't help but, you know, and they don't make native food in the palace. They don't, right? My princess, then you shouldn't go by yourself. Why? 
Send me. Yes. Send me. I can go get you the food. Uh, okay. Okay. You know what? Just never mind. My princess. Yes. I'm sorry. I'll go with you. What do I owe this August visit? No, I am here to see you and your son. It's unfortunate my son is not around. I hope all is well. All is well. But I want you to warn him. I want you to warn your son, Ojuku. Warn him. Oh no. Your son, Ojuku, is having a secret affair. My son? Yes, your son, Ojuku. So I've come to warn you, to warn him, for him to stay clear from my wife. Because the next time I will visit you people, I am going to visit you people in a different color. So warn him. <laughs> My son Ojuku having an affair with the princess. Oh, you are going to call? Yeah? you know how much I care about you. But you just have to understand. Now that my fiance is around, you just you just have to, have to understand. Ikenga. I cannot leave you. You are everything to me. You know very well that I rejected three suitors in the past all because of you. And now you want to disappoint me? Ikenga, I love you so much more than any other woman can love you in this life. I love you, Ikenga. Mama, I, I know how much you love me. And I know you truly love me. That is not the point. The point is Adan and my fiancé is in town. So we're going to get married anytime soon, so I want you to understand. Ikenga, I can't let you go. I would rather kill myself for you than to let you slip off my fingers. I can't. Mama, take the money. Take this money and go. I mean, go somewhere, disappear. Go wherever you want to go. Start a new life entirely, right? Mama, I want you to understand something. I cannot and will not jeopardize the relationship that has been in existence between Adana's parents and my parents. I will not jeopardize it. And I also want you to know this, that even though I am hungry, I cannot be bought with this money. Why don't you take this money to Adana? Tell her to start up a new life. Take your money. I don't want your money. It's you that I want. Oh. Please, take the money. You need it. You will need it. I don't need your money. Give it to Adana, not me. You would 
of drinking this money, I would have still added more to it. Why did you take the princess to such a place? Do you think the king will be happy with you if he hears about it? Papa, I tried all I could to stop her. But Princess Adana was hell-bent on going there. But you shouldn't have taken her to that place at all. That kind of place is not meant for such somebody like that. But I told her. I told her, I told her, but she wouldn't listen to me. Don't take her to that place again. I repeat myself. Don't take her to that place again. Very Papa. I, I am sorry. I, I promise I would never take her there again. But Papa, I just wish you understand with me. I don't know why she has this strong love for local food. You've had me, my son. The king is a very good friend of mine. So you have to be careful. Go inside. I'm sorry. I'm not ready. Look at it. What is a general local canteen? Local canteen. Yeah. Jane, can I ask you a question? Yes. Go on. How do you know when a man loves a woman? My princess, this is a very difficult question, but I will try. Okay. My princess, when a man loves a woman, he hardly breaks her heart. And his major concern is to make sure that that woman is happy. He cares for the woman. That's my opinion, my princess. Mm -hmm. Nicely put. not been visiting for a very long time now and you are not bothered to visit him I hope all is well all is well mother I mean we talk on the phone that is not enough you should be seeing each other as often as possible so you can get acquainted with each other oh. you, you were separated for 10 years Ten good years. You need time to get used to each other now. We are already used to each other, mother. I mean, <laughs> King and I were engaged long before I left for the States to oh, study, so... That is not what I'm saying, my beautiful queen. I mean, you should be close to him now that you are back. Very close, so that you could know him very well. Oh, yes. All right, then, my man. I'll, I'll give him a call. I'll visit him soon. Visit him tomorrow. Yeah. He is a man. You need time to study and understand him very well. Oh, I can see him here. Mm. <laughs> All right, mother, I've heard you. Princess, your mother is saying the right thing, you know. She is. Yeah. Your Highness. Yes. We cannot keep quiet and watch Ole Dorum's alive. It's time you call her to order. She cannot be drinking herself to stupor all the time. You are right. Hmm. So where is she? I, I want to see her immediately. She's hmm? not yet back. And nobody knows her whereabouts. What? Are you telling me all that is not in this house? That is what I'm saying. She's still outside by now. Yes. What 
kind of rubbish is this? Did you call her line? But uh, yes, I wanted to tell you I called her and her phones are off. That is why I'm so worried about her. Look at her. She's drunk again. Hey, Ole. Ole do. Take her into her room. Mommy, you should be happy that your daughter is now. Hey, your highness, your highness. What are you waiting for? Take her inside. Father, I'm not drunk, father. You are not drunk. It's good to drink away your sorrow, father. Come on, leave me. Please, I am here to see the princess. Tell her I'm around. Wait. I want to ask you something. Do you think she loves you? What do you mean? I mean the princess, of course. Yes. Are you surprised? Well, I have been watching you lately. Yes. And I noticed how much you admire her. I even made inquiries about both of you. And I was told that both of you were having secret affairs before she even left for her studies. Jane! Please, do not put me into problems. Please, just go in there and tell the princess I'm here to see her. Now I know why you want to quit this relationship. Why? My, my princess. How are you? I am fine. I didn't know you were here. I was just telling my mother about you. I, I just came in now. I actually came to give you this. Oh, wow. <laughs> Look at that. Thanks. You're welcome, my princess. Please take it inside for me, Jane. Why do you have to be in such a hurry every time? Um, it would be great if you said so we chit chat a bit. No? Uh, my princess, I I wish I could, but um, my father is waiting for me at home. Uh, please, let's do it some other time. Please. Okay. Thank you. Will you take me home then? I'd like to learn. Yes, I will, my princess. Yeah. I have to go now. No matter what has happened in the past, you have no reason to, 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 to kill yourself. You have no reason to drink off your life. 
You have no reason to drink to stupor. Don't you know it is very disgraceful? Well, let you know what is wrong with you. She nearly killed herself yesterday. Yes. If not for that kind man, that good man that saw your condition and decided to bring you home, you would have killed yourself. According to him, he said, you almost ran into a heavy truck. Is that true? Father, is it not better I die than to live with the memories of what both of you did to me? What? You don't make such comment. Don't make that statement again. It is wrong of you. I have no apologies for whatsoever I say. Father, the past government gave you a scholarship award for your daughter to study abroad. But what did you do? You gave the scholarship to another man's daughter. Father, why? Holy, do you know the reason I did that? No reason is enough for you to act so stupidly. Holy, do you are talking to your father? Mother, eh? Holy, do I'm angry right now. I'm very angry right now. Put yourself in my shoes and tell me if you will not feel the same way I do. Father, you value another man's daughter more than me. No. Adana is not a stranger. Adana is your brother's fiancée. Yes. And one day she will become a member of this family. And you know it. Oledo, why not understand? Oledo, why not take it easy? I am ready to do anything, anything, to make it up to you. Please. Oledo, please. Calm down and listen to your father. Okay? Too late. I'm sorry. Yeah, come, 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 come here. Oledo. Don't dare walk out on me. Don't try it. Only to don't make me regret of having you as my daughter. Don't. don't say it. You must be very careful. Be careful. Only do. Only do. Oledo, do you know you are disrespecting your father? Oledo, why can't you calm down and listen to your father for once? He is your father. You ought to respect him. I don't want to hear it. Sure. Come on, let's sit down. If this is a joke, you better stop it. A joke? Okay? Yes. What do you mean? What are we doing here? We're here to have lunch. You know that. See, this is where I have my meals whenever they cook meals I don't like in the house. Then you must be out of your mind. I don't know, you're learned. For crying out loud, you out. I mean, you should behave as one. This place, this place, this place is not meant for people like you and I. Not at all. Why are you throwing tantrums? You know what? I hate it when elites like you try to provoke my anger. I don't like it. Okay? And thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much for embarrassing me before those commoners here. Have a nice day. I don't know. Oh, my princess, I'm sorry for that. It's okay. Let's eat, shall we? Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
welcome once again. Thank you. It's good to have <laughs> you here. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um, I was supposed to come with my brother. Yeah. But my father sent me somewhere, so I couldn't wait for him. Ah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> That's a shame, though. I expected to see both of you. Mm -mm. So when you see him, you let that man know I'm disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> that one is not a problem. Um, maybe he can still come some other time. Yeah, I'm always here. So, how is everything? Everything good, girl. You've seen me. <laughs> <laughs> Um, have I told you this before? Tell me what? <laughs> My father secured this scholarship for me. Shut up. <laughs> Your father? Yes, that is true. I will soon be traveling out of the country. No way! And by the time I come back, my level will change. Oh my. I'm being the same level with you again. Look at you! Oh my God. Congratulations! <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> You're not kidding, are you? I'm not. I'm serious. Congratulations <laughs> again. <laughs> oh, man, look at that. You know what I'm going to do? I'll get my father to get me an admission, too. So I can travel abroad. You don't want to leave me here. Go anywhere. <laughs> Seriously, you never know. I just might go before you. Ah, uh, you are dreaming. I'm not. Look at what you're saying. I'm not kidding. Mine has already been secured. But you're saying you persuade your father to do that for you. Ah, so can you see okay. the difference? Wanna make a bet? You are kidding me. Wanna make a bet? Okay. Let's bet. No, she actually did. I will travel before you. You see. <laughs> okay. I'll get you. You see. You will not. I will leave before you. Wait and see. <laughs> you are unbelievable. I'm not. All right, we'll see. <laughs> How was I to know she was going to take away the scholarship my own father secured for me? I... It seems as if the world was against me. And then now... Uh, I feel like killing that girl with my bare hands. You should take the blame. Me? What did I do? I mean, you, you, you shouldn't have taken him to such a lonely place. Knowing his tattoos and, and, and yours. Eh? I, I wonder how you located such a place. Mother, listen. Nothing you say here will ever justify the scene he can get created for nothing. He insulted me. And then he went ahead and made a scene in front of my guards and maidens. You insulted him first. And I advise you call him and apologize. I should call him and apologize? Yes. And do not allow your father to hear about this. I don't know what has come over him. I don't believe this. Good afternoon, my princess. Good afternoon. Please, I'm here to see the prince. Is he around? No, he's not around. Oh, oh okay. Please, give him this when he comes back. Please, give this to him. Make sure it gets to him. Very important. I'll deliver to him. Okay, thank you. Okay, my princess, later. All right. Come 
Come Let me have the letter. It's for the prince. I still let me have. Come on, give it to me. Comes the British trained doctor. <laughs> huh. Look who finally decided to come say hello. Can I get a hug? Ooh, pretty. It's a pity we have not seen since you came back. Because you have been avoiding me, my friend. Congratulations to you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, how are you? Have you been? I'm cool. I'm, I'm all right. <laughs> Why have you been avoiding me? Was I? I don't think so. Really? Yeah. Really? <laughs> you? Hey, no, 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 no. What um, is it? Well, um, if you are here to see my brother, it might interest you to know that he's not here. Oh, shame. <laughs> <laughs> At least I can wait for him. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, no, no. What now, Ola? <sighs> Something wrong? You don't want me to go inside? No, I'm not. But I think um, it might interest you to have a look at this. What is this? Never mind. It's not necessary. My brother's wife, I mean mistress, is three months pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> you got jokes. You're kidding, right? I'm not kidding. You can call your fiancé or whatever you call him to find out the rest. Once again, you're welcome. Excuse me. You're not kidding? Ola, you're not kidding? My brother's wife, I mean mistress, is three months pregnant. You can call your fiancé or whatever you call him to find out the rest. have called by now. Don't 
does it mean he has not gotten my message? She's calling to know if you have received her message. <clears throat> Olaido, what are you talking about? She was here in the afternoon when you were not around. Who? The content is so interesting. What the hell are you talking about, Ola? <laughs> are you afraid to check the content? Okay, I will tell you. She asked me to give this to you. And I checked and found out that it is a pregnancy test result. What? I think she's pregnant for you. <laughs> How do we know that? <laughs> what is going on here? Oh, mother, thank God you are here. Your son's mistress is three months pregnant for him. Ikenga, <laughs> what exactly is she talking about? Mom, I don't know the nonsense she's talking about. Mother! <laughs> okay! You can check. Oh my goodness, you can check the content if you don't believe me. <laughs> you can go, let me have it. Hola, I will not take this nonsense from you. Is that clear? Excuse me. Okay, let me know. Hola! Hola! It's not the best time to go, okay? This is unbelievable. It's unbelievable. I mean, why, 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 should, why should the Loma do this? Eh? Why did she hand this thing over to, to, to Ola? 
Lola must have told her that everything. She must have told her everything. How am I going to explain this? Where do I start from? Huh? What do you want me to tell you? Huh? What do you want me to tell you? Jane, the princess has been in touch since you came back from Umango Kingdom. Is anything the matter? Uju, I don't really know. She has not been herself ever since we left Umango. Mm. And she even refused to open the door for me when the queen sent me to go and call her. I, I think know. something is wrong and I think it has something to do with Prissy Kenga. Yeah! Uju! Yes? Look at me please. I don't want any problem. Do you want to put words into my mouth? Okay. I just told you I don't know. Sorry, sorry. Ah. Okay, I just wanted to know. It's okay. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Welcome, Rodrigo. Thank you. Um, I'm here to see the princess. Is she around? Yes, she is, but she's sleeping and she's instructed she doesn't want any disturbance at the moment. Okay, um, tell her I was here when she wakes up, okay? Okay, I will. Mm, I have to take my leave now. Alright, bye-bye. Take care. Okay. okay. on him. Jane, I'm talking to you. Why did you do that? <clears throat> I don't want to set my eyes on him. Did you hear me? He is so wicked and heartless. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? Oh, wait. You think you can win his love back by being rude to him? Huh? I don't understand. <laughs> you will. You will. Is that why you're laughing? Uh-huh. What are you two doing here? It is my friend. It is my friend. Have you checked on my daughter? No, my friend. Do it now. Okay, my friend. Hey, you. Don't you have anything to do with you? Um, I'm done with my domestic choice, my friend. Is the meaning of this? Answer me now before I strangle you. What is the meaning of that? You want me to talk? Then, then talk. Oh, Kinga. Uh, if you haven't gone through it, well, it may interest you to know that I am pregnant for you. Pregnant for me? Yes. I will not let you blackmail me. I will not let you blackmail me with this cheap agreement. Is that clear? Ikenga, take me to any hospital of your choice for another test. If you are doubting me, yes. That's nonsense. 
Nonsense! Now listen to me. Now listen to me. Good. For the last time, Oloma, I don't want to see you anywhere near me or near my house. Else you will regret it. You cannot scare me away with your empty threats. Instead, I will best come to your parents and tell them everything they need to know. You tell me for the last time, nowhere near me, nor my house. Then do the right thing. Do the right thing, Ikenga. Do the right thing, Ikenga. Do the right thing. <laughs> Do the right thing. Oh, Lord. Are you aware of the implication of what you have just told us? Father, mother can bear witness that Ikenga refused to open the letter in her presence. Instead, he walked away with it. Mm. Uh, my queen. Yes, Your Highness. Have you in any way called Ikenga to know the content of that letter? Ikenga has been avoiding me since that time. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, um, Mikenga, please. Come this way. Is there anything the matter? Sit down. Have your seat, please. Mikenga. Ed. Who is the young girl that brought a pregnancy test result yesterday. Oloma, that's her name. Oloma. Is she the same girl I saw here with you some time ago? Yes, ma'am. Ikenga, what did I tell you about that girl? That's all right. And the test says it is three months pregnancy. Is it true or false? It's not true, Dad. She's only trying to blackmail me, that's it. Are you sure? There's, there's no truth in it. Oh, blackmail. Can I have the result? Uh, I returned it. Hmm. I want to see that girl tomorrow. And Father, there will be no need for that. That will just be a waste of time. What do you mean it is a waste of time? There is no need. I said I want to see that girl tomorrow. And you are telling me it's a waste of time? Listen to me. You just have to pass my information to that girl. Do I make myself clear? Oledo, will you shut up your mouth? This is not a laughing matter. And for your information, I don't want to hear this outside this palace. Do you hear me? Don't mention it outside here.
Oh, you go get it? You're back already. Uh, yes, the cabinet meeting did not hold it there. Why? Uh, what happened? Nothing so serious. Papa, mm -hmm. did you uh, did you see my princess? <laughs> this is your princess. Actually, I did not see him. But um, take this. Uh, it was said to bring uh, get him up and wine tomorrow. Okay, Papa. Yeah. Thank you very much, Papa. I want to him. Mba. Mba, thank you very much. Uh, okay, this is it. Mba, thank you. How did you come about this result? From the hospital, your highlights. From the hospital? Are you actually pregnant or are you just trying to play some pranks? It is not a joke, your highness. I am pregnant. And my son is responsible for it? Yes, your highness. Father, she's lying. She's, she's not pregnant. Will you shut up your mouth? Mother, don't tell me to shut up. You brought this upon yourself. She's trying to tarnish my image in this kingdom and I won't take it from her. I say shut up! Don't say a word. Shut up. Your Highness, I am not lying to you. Okay, if you don't believe me, why don't you take me to another hospital for a fresh test, yes? There is no point for that. Uh, there is no need to prolong this matter. I know my son. I want you to understand that uh, my son here has been betrothed to the princess of a Ruberry kingdom. And that on no account will I hear anything about this matter in this house again. Hmm? All right. Um, That is it. Come on, have it. Come on, have it. I want you to go to the hospital and terminate that pregnancy with immediate effect. Yes, my dear. Okay. Yes. Take the money. You can use it and take care of yourself after that abortion, okay? Just do it. Use it. Any, anything you want to you do with the money, do it. And let my son alone. Father, you should have investigated. We should have investigated before doing anything. Will you shut up your mouth? Shut up for once. You brought the ant infested wood into this home. And so, I do not want you to say even a word again. The king, are you not ashamed of yourself? He should be ashamed of himself, actually. The <gasps> king. Will you shut up, I said, shut up. You are leaving. I know they must have paid you to abort the pregnancy. Well, give me a call tomorrow.
And what were you telling her? How much did you give her to her body pregnancy? Ola, do you think you can tarnish my image by doing all this you're doing? I have done nothing. Are you angry because I reported it to father? See, I'm doing you a favor. Considering the fact that you are the future king of this land. You know what? I truly don't have anything to tell you now. Oh, yes, I, I, I saw your call, but I was busy when you called, so I forgot to call you back. I forgot to return your calls. That's it. You didn't pick because you knew why I was calling you, right? Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. What are you talking about? It wasn't intentional, like I said. I, I, I wanted to call you back, but I forgot. That's it. So tell me about this girl who is pregnant with you. What girl? What, what are you talking about? Three months pregnant. She is three months pregnant for you. Is that, is that correct? What exactly are you talking about? I, I don't know what you're talking about. Make yourself comfortable. Sit. You should quit lying. Because your sister, Oledu, has told me everything. Get out of my room. I'm asking you for the last time. What did you tell Adana? He came I'm warning you. Get out of my room! Greetings, my princess. The king demands to see you at the living room. Tell him I've 
meet him shortly. Okay, my princess. Um, Ojuku was here not long ago. He said I should give you this. He gave you a letter? Yes, my princess. Drop it over there. between myself and the king of the Rubele kingdom? Why do you have to behave that way? Why? Eh? Only the why. Why did you do a thing like that? Why? Now tell me, what do you stand to gain by this your stupid attitude, if I may call it? What do you stand to gain? Adama was there when Oloma gave it to me. I didn't know how to hide it from her. Come on, stop lying. Stop lying because I know Adana would not force you to give out such information to her. I know. Your Highness, I suggest we invite Adana here immediately. Because it will be disastrous if she tells her parents about it. And you think she has not done that already? Her father would have called you if he has been given such information. Yes. I think you are right. I will send for Adana immediately. Please do. Please. Oh, all life is going to pay. All life is going to pay then. She's going to pay. If she dare destroy the relationship that I have with Adana, she will pay dearly with her life. The Kinga, you better keep quiet and have your seat. Father, I am not going to shut up. I won't shut up. He can't die. He can't die. He said, shut up your mouth for once and let me handle this matter myself. Do I make myself clear? Shut up. It's okay, Ikenga, please. Listen to your father first. Let him handle it. You better handle it. Please. That was what happened, Father. This is unbelievable. You mean you called the king of Alice and he banged the phone on you? Yes. But Adana, I blame you. Why should you keep this all to yourself? All this why? I told her the same thing. Your Highness, what are we going to do? This is a very serious matter. I'll think about it. Father, I'm sorry, but I have to tell you right now that I'm no longer interested in marrying the king. Hmm? He should marry his mistress, don't you think? Ajana! It's okay. Allow your father to make the decision. I already made my decision. My dear Princess Adana, I came to see you but I was told I could not see you. I hope all is well with you. I do not know how to start but 
I just want to let you know that my heart still longs for you. My angel. Our past is still fresh in my memory. We loved each other from our secondary school days. That we even promised to marry each other. We kept this dream until Prince Ikenga came into the picture. Before we knew it, Igwe Umago's scholarship award to you and the proposal for his son to marry you in return changed our dream. I still love you, my princess. I still love you. From Ujuku. What has my son gotten me into? How will I solve this problem? Your Highness. Is everything alright? Everything is not alright. What happened? I just finished calling the princess. And what did she say? She said she has reported the matter to her father. Hey! You can't get up that one more. What kind of temptation is this? Hmm. Eh? You need to call him immediately. Call he, her father now, now, please. She said her father is on his way to the palace. On his way to this place? Yes. He didn't even care to call or to tell you that he is coming. He's unlike him. Oh, oh, could it be he is angry? I don't know. I, I think so. But I just have to keep my fingers crossed hey. till he comes. Hey. You serious? Hi. Adama's father will be here any moment from now. What is he going to do? I think he's coming to see your father concerning the recent development. Adana told him everything. So how did you get information? Your father said he spoke with Adana not long ago. Ikenga, I blame you for this. Ikenga. I blame you for all this. No. Ola should be blamed for all this. No. If Ola hadn't told Adana, I mean, it wouldn't have gone out. So Ola should be blamed for everything. You can't get you started it. What were you doing with Uloma when you knew you were in a serious relationship with Adana? It wouldn't have gotten to this level if you didn't get her pregnant. You are the cause. Yes, you are the cause, Ikenga. Oh, I know I am the cause. I know, but Allah. Allah should be cautioned. You need to caution her. Mom, if she finally, if she eventually succeeds to destroy this relationship that I have with Adana, I swear to God, I will vent my anger on her. I will. Ikenga, I will caution your sister, but you have to learn from your mistake. Imagine dragging our name. Can't you see it? Can't you see what you've cost? If she hadn't spoken, this thing wouldn't have gone outside. Hey! So it's all her fault. Blame her, not me. <sighs> oh, yeah. <gasps> My princess. <laughs> this place is not safe. And you know we have no guard with us. Relax, nothing will happen. Ha! 
My princess, something will happen now because your father will not be happy that we went out without a guard. Mm -hmm. He will be angry. <sighs> this place is somehow. My princess, we've been here for too long now. Eh? Who are we even waiting for? Are you sure he or she will show up? Jane. Jane, you asked too many questions. Would you relax? Okay. I'm sorry, my princess. <gasps> oh, here he comes. Please excuse us. Okay. Princess, I am. I am very sorry. I am very sorry for keeping you waiting. Okay, I, I was a bit tied up at it's my home. Okay. Okay. I got your letter. Okay. I had no idea you still had such feelings for me. My princess, I am ready to die for you. I mean, I. I feel mad each time I remember the past we shared together. Yes. What? Yes. But you know I am engaged to the Prince of Omoago Kingdom. And, and so what am I supposed to do with this? How do you expect that, that you and I start all over again? I do not know. Seriously, my princess, I don't. I just want you to know that I still love you. I will never ever break your heart. It's a promise. It's a promise I will never break for the rest of my life. Oh, I don't believe this is happening. I mean... My, uh, my father, my father will, will kill both of us if he ever finds out about this. My princess, please. I promise you, he will never find out. Well, will you take me to the bush tomorrow? Bush? What for? Hunting. <laughs> I want you to teach me how to hunt. Will you? Yes, I will. I still love you. Everything you said. It's okay. I I will be on my way right now. Okay, um, no problem. Just keep your phone on. I'll talk to you tomorrow. My phone is always on, no problem. I I really appreciate my princess. God bless you for me. Alright, alright, bye. <laughs> die for you. I mean, I, I feel mad each time I remember the past we shared together. Though I am engaged to the Prince of Omoago Kingdom. And, and so, what am I supposed to do with this? 
How do you expect that, that you and I start all over again? I do not know. Seriously, my princess, I don't. I just want you to know that I still love you. I will never ever break your heart. It's a promise. It's a promise I will never break for the rest of my life. Come in. My princess, the king wants to see you. Did he ask when we went earlier? No, my princess. Tell him I'll join him in a bit. Father. What is your reason? I changed my mind. I will no longer marry Kinga. She betrayed my love for him. Adana, I thought you have accepted the settlement made by your father and the Kinga's father over this matter. Why this sudden change of mind? I will not marry a man that has another lady carrying his child. Were you not told that the lady in question was asked about the child? An abortion. An abortion, mother. Can you hear yourself? That's just, that's just wrong and unfair. And I'm certainly not a party to it. I don't know. I have resolved this issue with my good friend, Udenta. And you have no right whatsoever to do anything contrary to that. Let me not hear that you reject his calls again. Did I make myself clear? I don't know. Actually, I understand how it feels for a man to break a woman's heart. But on the other hand, one has to take precaution so as not to make a mistake that will last for a lifetime. So here, yeah. Mother, Father cannot force me into this. Neither will you. I won't let any of you do this to me. I mean, who are we even talking about here? Ikenga. The same guy who has no love for me, has no respect for anybody. He cheats on me. He is arrogant. He, 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 he's a philanderer from what we can see, what we know of him. You know, it's wrong. It's wrong, mother. It's wrong for you and father to try to trade my happiness on, on the altar of a scholarship I got years ago. Will you shut your mouth? What has come over you? Nothing. You're my mother. And I'm supposed to tell you how I feel. The way I feel it. No matter how you feel, you have no reason to disobey your father. He has the final say in this matter. No, he doesn't. I have the final say. And you see this happiness of mine? I will fight for it even if I have to. Excuse me, mother. Ask not to step your foot into those palace. Right you wand? I said I came to see you, Ikenga. I came to see you. Now for the last time I am warning you. 
Do not step your foot into this palace. Right? Now leave now before I ask the guards to treat the out of his company. Are you that foolish that you cannot listen and hear me out? Are you? Jesus! Ah! Are you that stupid? Did you just call ah! me foolish? Did you? Kinga, you slapped me. You slapped me, Kinga. Kinga, let me tell you this. I swear you will never go free from this. I must have my band of flesh. That I promise you. Throw out of this camera now. I said you throw out. Oh my God. Throw out. Get it. Get it out. Throw out. You can't get me. You can't get me. Throw out of this camera. I swear, you will never go free from this. You must have my of blood. That I promise you. Take it. Oh, God, God, for you. Fuck it. You will never go Are you not Adana's media? I am, my prince. Well, I was told she went out. Do you know where I can find her? Yes, my prince. She went out to home. Alone? Yes. My prince. Um, sorry, I have an information that might interest you. Yes. All right, so go ahead and spill it. I'm, 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 I'm scared here. Here is no conducive for me to say that. Okay. So why not meet me somewhere tomorrow? Um, so you can tell me what you have to tell me. Okay, let me give you my number so you can call me. Transports. Oh, thank you, my friends. I'll give you a call. Yes. going? No, I haven't seen her. I saw her leaving the palace today, but she didn't tell me where she was going. Greetings, my princess. Greetings. I want to see Jane. Where is she? I did not see her, my princess. Isn't she in her room? Please check. She's not in the palace. No. I heard when she said she was going to get some drugs for herself today. Drugs? Yes, my princess. Is she ill? I, I guess so. I didn't know that. Well, let her know that I asked after her. Okay, when my she princess. returns. Okay, my princess. Why did you have to like the princess? Sometimes we need to be our colleague's keeper. It might be your turn tomorrow. So you said the boy is um, a noble son? Yes, my prince. Please, my prince. I don't want Adana to know I was the one who gave you the information. Please. You don't have to worry about it. 
No need to worry. I know how to handle it, and I'll handle it with wisdom, okay? Okay, my prince. Um, I have to go now. Okay, um, hold on. I'll give you something for transport. Alright, so from now on, I want you to keep an eye on them. Alright? You get me every vital information that I may need. Okay. Alright? I'll be calling you time to time. Thank you. Thank you. It's all right, just go. Greetings, my princess. Greetings. Where are you coming from? I am coming from the farm. And uh, you? Where are you headed? I'm just taking a stroll with my people. All right. Care uh, to join us? Come on. is there to fight till it conquers. So hold on to it. Never let go. Never let go. You. All right, I'm good. Okay. And who is this? This animal you with? Excuse you? I mean the animal. The fool. Stop it. Whatever happened to having respect for a fellow human being? Respect? Respect for who? For this thing. For this 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 thing. Well, by the way, I was headed to your house, so why don't you just Going to the castle, I'll take you home. Well, I was taking a stroll with my people. But feel free to head over to my house and have fun. I don't know, are you telling me off because of this? Because of this thing? Because of this Stop animal? Stop it! What is wrong with you? Do you have to be so damn rude and arrogant? self evolved much? What's your problem? Don't know what your tongue. This is a man like you! I don't know what your tongue. Right? What your tongue! I won't have you insult me in front of this 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 animal in front in front of this thing. Are you kidding? Is that clear? Yes. Good. Get into the car because I'm not leaving here without you. Good. Come on, let's go. My my, my princess, please. You should go with him. Really? I, I do not have strength for troubles. There is no trouble looming, trust me. I don't know, your father is going to hear this. Now he's gonna report me to Dada. Alright, that should be fun. Daddy's waiting for you. And have fun while you're at it. My princess! What? Please, you should go with him already. Come on. No. Come on. I'm not going to report you, but you do what I'm doing. Falling apart and the center cannot hold anymore. What happens? 
Minus I met Adanda on my way to this place. What had she done this time around? I met her with one riffraff. And she wasn't with her car. I told her I was coming here so she should join me. Adana looked at me at the face and told me she wasn't coming with me because she was discussing with one riffraff. With one thing. Wait. Are you saying that my daughter sent this to you? My queen, you know I cannot lie to you. I am not lying. I know I have messed up in the past. But I've taken enough from her. My son, calm down. Calm down. Adana will soon be back. And she will tell me the reasons for her behaving callously towards you. Oh? It's all right. I, my king, my queen, I beg to take my leave immediately. I wouldn't want to stay here in this mood. Thank you very much. I wonder what is happening. I don't know what has come over your daughter. I don't know what is wrong with Adana. Come in. Greetings, my princess. Hello. My princess, mm -hmm. the king says he wants you to come at the living room. That you should come immediately. Oh, really? Yes, my princess. Here you go. Okay. Tell him I'll be with you shortly. Okay, my princess. changing my mind. Nothing can make me change my mind. Kenga came here this afternoon and reported that you embarrassed and humiliated him in presence of a stranger. Is that true? Here we go again. Father, does Ikenga have to report everything to you? I mean, isn't he man enough to handle his business? You have not answered my question. I did not embarrass him, Daddy. I didn't. In fact, it was Ikenga that embarrassed himself. He's very rude and, and arrogant, and he has no respect for anybody. I don't know where I am. Where am I? Ikenga is off tempered. Thank you. You should learn to tolerate him. Excuse me? Tolerate a man who is highly temperamental? So that what, if hypothetically I end up dead, people can blame my death on his temperament? That is unacceptable, mother. Adana, you have not answered my question. Daddy, I did not embarrass the man. Then who was the man he met you with? My friend. Your friend. 
What kind of friend is he to you? He is my lover. He's the love of my life. I have decided to shift the date of my daughter's traditional wedding. Your Highness, what happened? All is not well. Oh no. You know you are somebody I will not hide anything from. It is my daughter, Adana. The princess. What has she done? She said she's in love with another man. Imagine. What brought about that? Hmm. Prince Ikenga impregnated another woman. And she heard about it and insisted she will never marry him again. Why could the prince do such a thing? Hmm. It's a long story. But the long of and short of it is that I have settled this with my good friend, Delta. Okay. But she refused to agree to that settlement. Just yesterday, she told us she's in love with another man. You see? Well, she told you who your man is. <laughs> she refused to talk. In that case, Your Highness, the first thing for us to do is to know who the young man is. And uh, I suggest you deter the whole guys to monitor her movement from now on. Immediately we identify the young man. We mandate him to leave the princess alone. That's my suggestion. I think I like your suggestion. I will do exactly that. Ajuku. I went to the palace okay. and Igwe told me something that gave me great concern. What happened? It's a top secret too. You might not say it. Don't say it to anybody. Don't you know your son again? I am very good in keeping secrets. Okay. Princess Adana is no more interested in marrying the Prince of Umuago, Ikenga. Uh, why? I told you this is a top secret. If you know you cannot keep it to yourself, let me keep it to myself. Mm -mm. But I will keep it a secret. They said another lady is pregnant for the Prince. Hey! What do you Hey! Go down, sit down. What do you Bring your voice down. I'm sorry. I told you this is a secret. I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh. Hey? What happened? Because another lady is pregnant for the prince, Adana said he's no more going to marry the prince. That even she has seen another uh, lover that will marry her. Okay. But, uh, Papa, hmm? did uh, Princess Adana, did she disclose or Tell, uh, explain the person she's in love with, the man she's in love with. Mm, unfortunately, she refused to, you know, mention the person's name. Yeah. Nobody is aware of the person now. But promise me, you will not tell it to another party. Right? I promise, Papa. for the guy that drove her. Good. Mm -hmm. 
were you the guard that went out with my daughter? Yes, Your Highness. Where did you go to? She asked me to take her to the old primary school. That was where we went to. Old primary school. Was anyone waiting for her there? We got there before him. Who is he? One of his son. You mean Ojuku? Yes, he's the one I think. Okay, you can go. Thank you, Ines. Welcome, my son. His Majesty the King wants you at the palace immediately. Immediately? Yes, Nanyo, no. He said you should come with me. Did anything happen? I do not know, Nanyo. Okay, um, let me dress up. Okay, I'll now. go with you. Something came up yesterday and I sent for you. Who all is well Oh no, all is not well. Your son, Ujuku, is dating my daughter. My son? Anyway, there must be a mistake somewhere. Oh no. The guards I detailed to monitor my daughter's movement identified Ujuku, your son, as the one she said she's in love with. I sent for you to beg you to please talk to your son. My daughter is engaged to the Prince of Umuago. Because of the long-standing relationship I have with their king. Therefore, do not do anything that will jeopardize that relationship. Better advise him. I'll talk to my son. I'll talk to him. Better. Talk to him. Or he will face my wrath. And, uh, you know, it will be too disastrous for him. I don't know what are you trying to do. You know, initially I thought you were joking. 
But right now I've seen how serious you are about this thing. You're right, I am serious. I will not marry Ikenga. And if you think I never loved the man even before I left for my studies, that should compensate for something, don't you think? Ujuku is the only man that I love. Get it? On a long journey, even a straw, a light straw is heavy. Please, whatever you do, consider the relationship our father shares with his father. That old, royal, sacred relationship. Think about what your actions will do to it. Well, my life and my happiness is way more important than this relationship you just made reference to. Don't you think? I don't know, don't say that. Kinga is the right man for you. He is not. Did you hear me when I said I never loved him? I merely carried along with the entire arrangement with the hopes that eventually I would fall in love with him. Oh, but look, look what happened. While I was on my way to loving him, he betrayed me and got another girl pregnant. That pregnancy issue has been sorted out. Really? If by sorted you mean the arrangement for the girl to have an abortion, <laughs> I'd say bravo. I don't know, listen. Second thoughts are always the best. Hmm. I'll advise you to think twice. You and I know that father will never, ever let you to marry that boy. Hmm. We'll see. Facts are stubborn things. That is a fact. Ojuku! Alanga Keno! Ojuku! Papa! Bianca! Koya! Ali! I thought you went to the palace. Yes. I want to ask you one question. Is it true that you are dating? The princess. Papa. Huh? Papa, was that why the Igwe summoned you? That's not my question. Is it true that you are dating Princess Adana? That's my question. Ojuku? Yes, Papa. You are playing with fire. There are many beautiful ladies in this kingdom. Why the princess? Papa, I'm surprised. Eh? I'm surprised you're not happy your son is dating the princess of this kingdom. Papa, you should be proud of me now. Eh? You should be proud of me. Shut up! How can I be proud of you when you want to play with your life? For your information, Princess Adana is engaged to the Prince of Omoago. That's not true, Papa. Papa was already in love with Princess Adana before that emergency engagement with Prince of uh, 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 Prince Ikenga, the Prince of Omoago kingdom. Mm -hmm. But no, nothing is going to happen. Nothing will happen. I will marry Princess Adana and bring royalty to this family. I don't need that royalty. I don't need it. Adana is another man's wife. And I will not come out when the problem comes out. I don't need that because the royalty comes out. Be careful with yourself, oh. I've warned you, don't say they not tell you. I do not love him. Oh, you are talking about love. But we are talking about the good relationship your father has with Igu Denta. We will not allow you to drag your father's dignity to the dust. Well, if 
it's about the scholarship. We can, we can pay the man back. And what are you paying the tax on? What is it? Your Highness, we have to do something before this girl brings shame to this family. Look, I rather disown her than for her to bring shame to this kingdom. This is the last time I'm going to talk about this issue in this house. Please excuse me, Daddy, Mom. Talk to your daughter. I don't know what is really wrong with my daughter. I don't know. Talk to her. Talk sense into her before it's too late. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, my son. Uh, you are welcome. Wait, let me bring seat. Oh no, I'm not here to sit down. Court seat costs nothing. I'm aware you know the disaster your son is about to bring to this family. I urge you, warn your son. Let him stay off the princess. She's not his class. My prince, I've tried what I can do. Talk to my son. Only friend. Please. Hello. Talk to your son. What? What? You. Stay away from the princess. From today, henceforth. Light and darkness have nothing. Uguna, you are too small for. You are too small for this. Why are you supporting a forced marriage? Why? What is a forced marriage? Adana is properly and traditionally engaged to Prince Ikim. What is a forced marriage? Guna, you're lying. Guna, you know it deep down your heart that you are lying. I was first in love with Princess Adana before the so-called engagement. Go home. Go home to your sister. She should be in the best position to explain to you, to tell you the truth. You're a fool. You're a criminal. Who wants to weep where he did not sue? Beggars must never choose. Stay off your sister. I want you to be a and I want you to be Light and darkness have not been gone. Hasty climbers have sudden falls. Call you now. You didn't want to do what you show you allow. And you come here, Papa. And you come here. Be careful. You better go inside. Every time. So, this is how Princess Adana decided to pay back for all the things your father did for her. Hi. I am so disappointed in that girl. I thought she's responsible. Huh? <clears throat> Mother, I have this feeling that Adana is under a spell. I have this belief that that young man must have charmed her. And that is why I'd rather take this fight to Yubiri Kingdom and deal with that man. Deal with that boy. Deal with that hooligan. Deal with, I mean, deal with him. That stupid, stupid boy. 
Since no one wants to deal with him, I'll go there and deal with him. No. Don't. Don't do anything yet. Iguarono has promised your father that the situation will be put under control. So don't do anything yet. Let them finish first. And how did they intend to do it? Nobody knows, but how? I know. I know they will handle Mother, it. Mother, the Adana that I know is a very stubborn child. Very stubborn. Oledo, what's the meaning of that? I'm laughing, Mom. You're laughing. Ah. Hola. As you can see, we're having a very serious discussion before you interrupt it. Yes. Hmm. Serious discussion indeed. So Adana has finally disappointed us after all the scholarship award. Is it not funny? Will you stop that rubbish? Stop it for once. This is not the time for that. Oledo. Please leave us. Just leave here now. Leave us alone. Get out. I said leave! <laughs> so sorry, mom. All right, stop it. So my effort to stop Ujuku and the princess from getting married has proven abortive. Adana is hell bent on marrying him. My plan is to frustrate them. But the reverse is the case. What is happening? Jane, you are still standing here. See, if you would listen, no, I will advise you to let go of this. Before you put yourself into trouble, allow Chukwu and the princess to be. You will not listen now. Uji, what is the problem? Gloria, mind your business. Why is it that any time I get two of them talking together and they see me, he will just stop talking? I think something is fishy and I must find out. In this palace, I will find out. Thank you. 
No problem. I can see you are going out. Oh yes, I, I am. I'm going out. Without your maiden or your guard. Well, I feel like going out alone today. I see. So, where are you going? I'm going to Uma the Kingdom to reconcile with the kingdom. Beautiful smartness. <laughs> Can I see what you have in your boot? What? Yeah. What you have in your boot? plan has been forward. I'll talk to you later. Keep the bag and leave. Yes, I will talk to you when you are in your right mood. Doesn't mean that God spilled on me. Coming from, and what are you carrying? I'm asking you. Decided to elope with a man. I am disappointed in you. I am ashamed to be called your own father. I am so ashamed of you. She would have succeeded if not for your mother's timely intervention. What a nonsense! Ah, to fear what? I don't know what Ojuku gave to my daughter that makes her misbehave like this. I don't know. Now, let me declare. 
Adana ceases to be my own daughter if she doesn't reconcile with Ikenga and then put off that bad rubbish called uh, Ojuku. And uh, you have only this week. This week! I said this week to do that or else. Nonsense. You heard your father. I will also disown you if you fail to do as he said. Go ahead, mom. Disown me. I sincerely do not care. It's not like it's the first time you've been saying it. What has come over you, Adana? What do you mean, what has come over me? What is wrong with you? What has come over you? Are you under a spell? Listen, you are royalty. Light and darkness has nothing in common. I think this has gotten out of hand. It's high time I did something about it. I will definitely take a drastic measure. Prince, you are welcome. Where is Ojuku? He's around. Hold on. Ojuku! Bea? Ojuku, Bea? Papa? I want to go now. Go now! Ojuku, you have beaten more than you can chew. Leave this place. You have beaten more Papa, than you can chew. Leave this place now! Papa, very stupid. Me. Very stupid. Stupid. Papa? Yeah. Ask him to leave this cover now. Yeah, but someone has said, Papa! Now. Calm down, Ojuku. Listen. I have come here to give you last warning. Stay clear of my sister. I will not warn you again. Nah, come on. If I see you close to my sister again, you will go in for it. What will happen? Do you think I'm afraid of you? Do you think I'm afraid of you? Would you go? The, the prince of the land. Praise my foot, Papa. Who are you? If he's the so-called prince without giving the right to come into my compound and insult me, in Ampara. You are not ashamed of yourself. You are not ashamed. Yeah. Weak men. They talk too much. You're a weak man. That is why you decided to elope with my sister. You're not afraid. Next time, I will show you what I can do. Go now. Ibu Onyara. Ibu complete Onyara. I'm going to take him to the I will break you into pieces. Touch me. Don't you go. Try it. Hey. Touch me and watch your life slip away. You're just an empty vessel. You are Go now, you're an empty bag. vessel that makes the I said you're you an empty you bag. mad. And you can never. Ever stand upright. You are nothing before royals. And you know it. Don't dare me. Light and darkness don't have anything, anything whatsoever in common. Don't dare me, Ugona. Do not dare me, Ugona. Every dog has their day. Today is yours. And I will dash you for free. But next time, you will don't see my wrath. Don't dare me, Ugona. Ugona, do not dare me. I will bring you to pieces. In the butuki, I will mess you up. Stay up, my sister. If you don't want your life to end, it is not. Come on, so, so, bro, so we can say that. Come on, let's get out from here. Would you, Papa? Papa, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Come, let me ask you one thing. Is it? Okay, come. Next time you come into my compound again to say rubbish, I will bring you down there, Butugi. Give a dog a long rope, and he will hang himself. Don't dare me, Ugona. I will. Don't dare me. Show you the other side of me. Don't take anything at the back. Don't take anything at the back. Don't take Ugona, don't dare me. You cannot stand. To the house, the man I am. And you know it. I will beat you. I will beat you. I will beat you. And I warn you again. Don't ever come close to my sister. What will you do? I will. What will you do? you the other side of the man. You are insane. The Prince of Umago Kingdom. <laughs> Good to see Prince you. Prince Ikega. <laughs> so nice seeing you. Good to brother. see you, my brother. Hi. Hi. 
it's so good to see your beautiful face again. And thank you for forgiving me. My parents are waiting patiently for you guys. So you just yes, we should go inside. You're Prince of Omaku Kingdom. Prince of Kingdom himself. discuss with you is sensitive that's why I asked that you come all right <clears throat> I'm listening the reason I wanted us to look the last time is because the pressure from my parents especially my father was getting overbearing unfortunately we didn't succeed in looking and as I speak to you now that pressure is back on and it's, it's about to consume me. I cannot bear it anymore. What are you trying to say? I'm saying that... I'm going back to Ikenga. I have no choice. My father is about to disown me. And it seems like the only reasonable thing to do. Please say something. True love is hard to find, but once you find it, it never goes, even if trouble comes. In times of hardship, is there to fight till it conquers? When the trouble comes in times of hardship, is there to fight till it conquers? She disappointed me and made a jest of me. I wouldn't have gone there if I had known that was the reason she wanted to see me. I made a fool of myself. You know, my parents are very happy for me. Yes. I saw it on their faces. Okay. Once again, thank you. Thank you very much for forgiving me. What about your sister? Oh, Ola. Ola is drunk. She's gone out. You know, she'll go out, drink, get drunk and come back home. You don't think she needs to see a counsellor? Uh, I, I wish she could, but um, I don't know. I wish I could talk to her. Oh, you know, I, I, I just want to thank you once more for forgiving me. You're welcome. You know, I have learnt my lessons. I have. I hope so. Yes, I have. Love beds. I can see you have settled your differences. <laughs> Congratulations. As for you, Princess Adana, I can see how desperate you are to marry my brother. Desperate one like you can go extra miles to get what she wants. Well, will you just go inside and let us be? I admire her gods. She's indeed a superwoman. Ola! Shut up! Don't you dare shout at me again.
Hi, Mom. My beautiful baby. Nell. Yes. <laughs> the most beautiful lady in Erubere Kingdom. Here we go. <laughs> My heavenly maid princess. Mom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it seems you are going out. Yes, I am. I have a date with you, Kinga. I see. I see. I have to hurry along now. He'll be waiting for me. It's okay. Please try and come back on time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I see. <laughs> You have come back to your senses. True love is hard to find, but once you find it, it never goes. Even if trouble comes, in times of hardship, it's there to fight till it conquers. So hold on to it, never let go, never let. I'm sure she's okay. I can't say. I can't just say. Yes, I should be asking you that. No, I'm good. <laughs> okay. 